are the first generation of immigrants who's come to this country that in that generation went from nothing to great success. I'm not just representing Persians. I'm representing the dream of American dream. I'm representing the dream of all the newcomers that come, no matter what minorities they are, where they are. While I was in space, there was a lot of coverage of the event, and I had the opportunity to speak to people from all over the world. So it was a way for me to get Iran on the map with a different view, associated with a different and positive set of news. You turn on the TV, everything is negative. They never show anything positive. They always show that weird guy, half naked, eyes bugged out, looking at the camera. <laughs> What you are seeing manifested in the immigrant community in this country when it comes to Iranian Americans is that we are not only scholars and uh, lawyers and doctors, but we are entertainers, we are in the media. When I did A Mice and Men, somebody says, what is going on here? Here is a Iranian and is doing a Steinbeck of Mice and Men. And I said, Steinbeck is not American, it's international. I said, when I was, in a drama school, I play George, and every word that he says is tattooed on my soul. At every step of my life, somebody has given me a chance in the United States. What my hope is, is to be able to help our wounded soldiers. So many of these young men and women are coming back missing arms. And hand transplantation now is an option. I went to Tehran University, had my degrees, and pursued the field of engineering afterward, but um, my heart was always in arts, and it still is. About eight years ago, I decided, you know, I really need to do something that's more related to art than just stay an engineer for the rest of my life. I think this exhibition can um, demonstrate to the American audience that in spite of the rhetorics and the differences uh, of opinion between the governments, people can stay together. I've been able to choose the good parts about both cultures. And in fact, I believe my experience and my family's experience and my children's experience will be much richer having the melting pot of both cultures. That's what America is about. America is great because of a melting pot. I became familiar with those meanings. And then those meanings now became clear in my heart for me. So those meanings are expressing themselves through my hand. So can I say it's Iran? I believe it's humanity, but I, I learned this humanity with that language. In every sphere of this American narrative, you will find an Iranian-American successful person who is giving of themselves, working hard to make sure that this country is growing and it is done with a lot of compassion and a lot of uh, trust and belief that we all want to make this land a better place for everybody.